I'm gently dropping our eggs into boiling water. And to get the perfect ramen soft to soft medium boil, I find five minutes is just right. Take a big old soup pot, and I'm browning up some Hen of the Woods mushrooms. I let them brown first before I add any salt. In this case, we're using soy sauce. That'll be our salt for the dish. I am dividing up a giant bunch of green onions into the whites or the lower half of the onion and the green tops with some shredded carrots, some matchstick of carrot. You can use a box grater to do this or do it by hand. Um, and about two inches, about this much, about two inches, the length of your thumb, of fresh ginger. I cut the ginger into matchsticks for this, so we get a lot of ginger power. The chicken, hello friend, rotisserie chicken. <laughs> Done in two minutes, as quick as you can remove the skin and chop that sucker up. Um, and then any leafy greens you like. I have some spinach here. So we have high temperature cooking oil in here. That's oil you can see through. Then we're gonna put in that mixture of the whites of the green onions, the ginger, and our carrots. You can use any mix of vegetables in here you like, of course. Now, for the liquid, we're going to add about a third of a cup of soy sauce, liquid amino or low sodium soy sauce if you're watching your sodium intake. That's about three turns of the pan. Give that a stir. Then we're gonna add some sweet mirin. This is uh, rice wine. Sweet cooking, rice seasoning, really. Couple of turns of the pan. And then a little bit of miso paste. White or golden yellow miso paste. Give that a stir. And now we can throw in our garlic because there's a little liquid in there. And we're going to get in our bone broth or stock in a box. We're gonna get all that into the hot tub of love. So I'm gonna wilt the greens into the soup. So eight ounces for four adult portions. I get a bonus ounce because these were three ounce discs of ramen. The beauty of this is that they cook in just a couple of minutes, of course. Tongaroos. And just start working them every couple of minutes. I drained off our ramen, I put a little of the green tops in there, and I drizzled it with toasted sesame oil. Yum. So here's how we bowl, huh? <laughs> All right, so we take some ramen, and then we take our spinach and vegetables and ginger and garlic and broth and mushrooms, and pour that over the top. We're gonna let the chicken rest. We're gonna take some of our spicy radishes, and let them hang out with chicken. Which came first, the chicken or the egg? I don't know, but they can hang together. <laughs> See that beautiful, look at that golden delicious. And then a little bit of our hot pepper. And a little bit of our shiso leaf. And then, big finish, Lil Sriracha. 